Gang, welcome back to the channel, man. It's your boy Six, man. We back outside. We back here. Y'all already know what we got going on today, man. I told y'all on the last video that the next video was probably going to be the start of the rap process game. I know y'all didn't believe me. I know everybody was like, yo, he cap, man. He mean cap, man. He ain't even ordered the rap. He been saying he gonna rap the car for months. He ain't never gonna rap the car. Well, look, gang. The rap came in. <laughs> I'm about to go reveal it. I haven't even looked at the rap yet, gang. I haven't even looked at the color yet. I know what color I ordered. So, basically, I ordered my rap off a website called Metro Restyling. It's like a bulk rap, bulk vinyl uh, website where you can order vinyl from. It's like where a lot of the vinyl, actual rap shops order their vinyl from. So, you know... They'll charge you like $3,000 to do it in the shop, but the wrap, the roll of wrap itself is like $300, $400, maybe $500, depending on what color they get. The reason it took me so long to get it is just because I had to get some funds in, gang. As I was speaking to y'all, I had to work on some things. I had to get some money in. So now, now that I got that in, we got a lot of stuff on the way, gang. I'm talking downpipe, intercooler, stage two, muffler delete. Everything is going to come up like now here or shortly in the next couple, next month or two. But today, I'm going to start wrapping the F30. So I'm going to try to knock out the side skirts, the front fenders. Looks like I knock out this panel, the side skirts today, and this fender up here on both sides. Let's go ahead and get the wrap color reveal game. We finna slide over the wheel spot, and he gonna help me out with some of the um with some of the panels, just like, cause I'm not, it's kind of hard to do it yourself when you gotta put a piece of vinyl all the way across the car, cause you know I don't, I don't my arms aren't my arms aren't ten feet long. So as y'all see, I got me a little coffee today, how I do my every Saturday, just to get the day going. We ready to get the car wrapped. Let's go inside and check out the color, man, because I haven't even looked at it. But when you look at the, the wraps on Metro Styling's website, the color that you look at on there is really not even the color that you're going to see when you when you actually get your wrap in game. So let's go check it out in person. Let's get it, gang. All right, gang. Here's the wrap, man. I ordered it from Hexus. Go ahead and reveal this to y'all. So I can see what we're working with. I went ahead and pulled it into the light. What y'all think is in here? Y'all think it's green, yellow, black, white, red? Ah! Ah, how beautiful. I don't know how well y'all can see this light. But. Here's the wrap, man. A 45 by five foot roll. Really only, really probably won't even need that. Really might only need like 40. But that's the color for y'all, man. I'll pull it back out one more time. So you see the metallic in there. So this color from Hexus is called Gloss Yasmarina Blue Metallic. So it's like Yasmarina. But it's got some metallic sparkles in there. And I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a very well-known brand. So, put my trust in them. Put my trust in them, gang. But yeah, like I said, we finna start wrapping the F30 today. Freaking finally. You like it, sis? My sis like the wrap color, gang. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. We finna get started right now, gang. Finna head over to Will Spot. I'm gonna catch y'all when we get over there. Y'all didn't know the freaking vibes, man. Let's get it. All right, y'all, so I'm about to get started. Just put up the wheel spot. You know, the regular, we got the 435 out here, but I'm about to get started wrapping the F30. So first thing I'm gonna do, probably gonna hit, I'm gonna hit the side skirt first. What you wanna do is go ahead and clay bar it. So definitely with any panel you're doing, you wanna make sure you get it cleaned off completely, get all the dust and everything off. So I'm about to hit it with some um, the Meguiar's. Hit it one time, wipe it off with the microfiber. Spray some more Meguiar's, hit it with the clay bar, wipe it off. You're gonna do that process twice, and then you're ready to wrap. So I'm gonna go ahead and start doing that now. What the clay bar is doing, guys, is it's just it's cleaning off all excess dust, all excess contaminants. Just really prepping the surface to be wrapped. Coming along nicely here. I have about half the stats. Going all right, right? Like slick. I'm gonna go ahead and get the, this other half done, but. So far, we're coming along pretty nicely. All right, gang. I ain't gonna lie, it was a little bit time consuming. It's a tad bit time consuming, but hey, we just knocked out the first side skirt, gang. There's a couple small, small minor imperfections you can't see on camera, but you ask me for the first time rap job, 
first time rapping an actual car, the whole car myself. I just did the side skirt and I think it looks pretty freaking good, gang. Everything tucked in nicely over here. Everything's tucked in all the way down. Everything's sticking well. I got everything nice and prepped well, so it's sticking good. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the other uh, side skirt, gang, and then might try to hit a fender or two, and then that'll probably be it for the day, gang. But hey, appreciate y'all for tapping in. Y'all already know it's your boy. It's your boy Six, man. Just working, man. Working. Trying to get the whip wrap. Let's get I'm over here, gang, through the driver's side. Side skirt. I'm not gonna lie. This side was almost easier. <laughs> We getting through it. I think this side is either just because I got used to the other side, so I was able to kind of get a groove for it, get a feel for it, just wrap and how it, how it bends, how it molds, how you know the right ways to to lay it down the proper, the easiest way. So I think I've learned the easier way to do this now. So getting through the second side skirt thing. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. I think it looks better on this side too because you can see the metallic. You can see the metallic in the in this in this wrap. This shit's hard. All right, gang, as y'all can see, it's already nighttime. I've been trying to grind on this shit. I got both the side skirts down. I try to start the rear bumper. When I tell y'all this is not a one man job and this rear bumper is not easy to wrap, that's all I'm gonna say. Cause it took me about an hour, two hours just to do the left corner. I haven't even got to this right corner yet, but I'm making my way through it. You guys can see I'm starting to get some progress in here. That side is, that side is already done completely. What's good, gang? Welcome back to the channel, man. It's the day after. It's the day after right now. I just want to update y'all, give y'all a little update on the F30, on the whip process. Man, when I tell y'all, it's not a one-man job. When I tell y'all, wrapping a whip is not a one-man job. Wrapping a whip is not easy. And I see why shops charge four, five grand to do these jobs, gang. That's all I can really say right now. I see. I understand why now. I, I completely understand. It's not a one-man job. I literally... Well, let me just show y'all the whip real quick. This is the update, right? So here's the F30 game. Yesterday, I was able to finish both side skirts and the rear bumper on my own. But when I tell you wrapping this rear bumper was such a pain, <laughs> literally the side skirts probably took me like three hours to do both. The rear bumper probably took me like five hours to do. It's to just to do the rear bumper. And I have a lot of imperfections minor very minor but you, you can't see on camera but there's some minor imperfections in here like a couple uh when i was making the cuts and i was trimming you know near the rear tail light um i don't know if you can kind of see like as you can see like right here just a minor just something really minor that you can't really tell on camera um but i feel like it's gonna come together really nicely i feel like once everything's done i just ordered a new um spoiler as well so i ordered a new spoiler um so when I do the trunk, I'll throw on the new spoiler. I got the CS style spoiler, the uh, M3CS, M4CS style spoiler. But yeah, gang, what y'all think about this color? Y'all let me know, man. Get out the way so y'all can see this. But yeah, you see, as you can see, guys, it's a little minor, minor, minor imperfections that you can't see unless you're looking super, super close and that you'll never see at night. You'll never see that at, at nighttime, but maybe if you look really close in the day, you might see those little imperfections, but I'm not really worried about it because this like i said this is this is a diy this is my own rap job this is me wrapping the car myself and i've never wrapped the car before and i'm doing it myself that front bumper i'm gonna have to have some help with that though i'm definitely gonna have some help because that rear bumper by itself was just the hardest thing i've ever done i literally i almost gave up <laughs> i almost gave up gang i almost just stopped when i was doing it because i literally couldn't get it to lay down and wrap properly i couldn't get it and i was alone and i was just frustrated it had been hours and i was trying to come home and watch watch the fight Watched the Izzy Adesanya fight last night. So I was like, yo, fuck, I just need to finish this shit. So I just ended up goddamn kind of rushing through it. That's why it's a couple imperfections on that rear bumper. But once I get that fender, once I get these rear fenders in, the, in, that, in that trunk wrap, then everything's going to come together nicely. And I'll probably do the doors and the hood and the, 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 um, the roof. And I'll definitely probably do the front bumper last just because it's, it's literally impossible. I don't, that's gonna, that's gonna be so fucking hard to wrap. I don't even wanna think about it. But yeah, gang, this is the wrap, the wrap reveal, gang. Yasmarina Blue Metallic. 
I'm gonna have the only F-30 and A that's gonna be this color game. Coming up next, gang, I'm about to order the intercooler and the downpipe and go stage two. I'm gonna get in the muffler delete first here. Hopefully, within this next week, I'm gonna chop the muffler off. Then I'll just go downpipe, muffler delete. I'll probably leave the resonator so it's not just incredibly, insanely loud. And then go stage two, gang. So, yeah, this is the F-30, gang. I appreciate y'all for tapping in, man. You already know. It's your boy, Six, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. I already know the vibes, man. Appreciate y'all for tapping in. It's a cold, chilly day. Super Bowl Sunday. Finna go catch the game. Do some homework real quick. But y'all know the vibes, man. The F30 coming along, man. We finna finish. We finna finish the fucking road, man. We, we on the road to greatness right now. We finna be tuned, making gunshots, and we finna be fully wrapped. Wrap the carbon hood. I'm probably right with hood carbon though. My boy took got some carbon in. Appreciate y'all, gang. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one. Let's get it. Man, gang, it's a couple days later. And this is a sad ending to a story that barely even got started. <laughs> so, gang, unfortunately, and I know you guys are gonna hate me. You guys are gonna be mad at me. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna get some hate probably. But I'm, I'm, there's a couple things that hopefully we'll be able to balance this out so you guys won't be too mad at me. But I won't be finishing the rap on the F30, gang. figured I should update you guys just because you guys are gonna wonder like damn you're not rapping it so no guys I'm actually not rapping the car anymore what I'm doing instead is I'm gonna just end up paint matching the um, bumpers and the side skirts to mineral gray um, the reason being the reason why I decided not to wrap it anymore in this color specifically when I wanted when I decided to wrap my car I wanted to wrap it a color a color that was gonna stand out that a lot of people weren't gonna have and I noticed when I ordered the wrap on the site, like I told you guys, I thought it was a different shade of blue. I thought it was like a darker shade of blue than what it was. I thought it was, I didn't think it was actually gonna be Yas Marina, the same exact Yas Marina that the M4s are, because it doesn't, doesn't, it didn't look like that on the site. However, it, it is the same Yas Marina that the M4s look like. And I saw an M4 the other day in Yas Marina and it just upset me because I was like, you know what? I don't even want to wrap my car this color. I don't want to have an F30 in Yas Marina. It's gonna look weird. and. I don't want to be looking the same as these M4s. I wanted to have a different type of vibe if I was going to wrap it. So I decided, I was just like, no, I'm not even going to do this. It's a pain in the ass. And I have somebody that wants to buy the wrap off of me right now for the same price I paid for it. So I'm about to just get the bumpers paint matched instead, instead of just doing all the work of wrapping it in a car that I'm not truly all the way in love with. I like the stealthy look of the car, the dark, the look of that gray, how it almost looks like black at night. I kind of like that. And I, I don't want to. I don't want to really lose the stealthiness of the car, so I'm just gonna keep it this way, gang. I'm gonna keep it mineral. I'm gonna um, paint master bumpers. But the reason why I said something might bounce it out, where you guys won't be so upset with me, is I'm gonna be going stage two boot mode soon. I'm getting the mustard lead now and intercooler downpipe, and then we'll be ready for stage two. That's what I'm about to do next now. Instead of instead of doing this wrap, I'm about to just paint match the bumpers. And look, I got the wrap right here. I'm about to go sell it right now. I'm about to paint master bumpers gang and just tune the car and then I'm just gonna sell the car mineral gray. I figured it'll be easier to sell it if it's an OEM color M Sport kit. Y'all know the vibes, man. That's the plan for the F30. I appreciate y'all for tapping into this video though, gang. Don't be upset with me because we're not wrapping the whip because we still got big things coming. And when the F30's paint master is still gonna look sexy, it's gonna look stealthy as hell at night, gang. I appreciate y'all for tapping in. I'm a holler.